Hello Aquarius, how are you? I hope this finds you well. So we are going to be doing your person on your mind reading. Whoever you're thinking about, that is who this reading is intended for. And everything that you'll need to know, whether it's about this reading or scheduling your personal readings, all of that is in the description box below for you. And we are inviting your angel spirit guides and ancestors to come in and assist us with this reading today. Tomorrow is the last day to get your orders in for the Zoom sale. It is a 30-minute Zoom reading for $45 or a one-hour Zoom reading for $60. And everything that you'll need to know is in the description box below for you. All right, my loves, let's take a look and see what we have going on for you guys. Their feelings towards you, Aquarius. We have the Nine of Cups. Their intentions towards you. We have the Eight of Cups. Their next actions and behaviors. We have the sun. The challenge between the two of you. We have the world. And the potential outcome. We have the king of swords. We got the ten of cups at the bottom of the deck. I kind of felt like that's where that was going. And then spirit put that out there for confirmation. So... All right, um, this is not going to resonate for all of you. I do feel like this is going to be more of a specific message, Aquarius. But I do feel like there's somebody here who, I do feel like this person's in a connection. They could be married. They could have a family. That's kind of what this is feeling like here uh, to me, especially with that Ten of Cups here. Or they're just in a connection, like they're just in a commitment with somebody else. Now, I do feel like, with their feelings, the Nine of Cups, I feel like this person really does enjoy being around you. They enjoy your company. They enjoy just spending time with you. They enjoy talking to you. They enjoy the way you make them feel. The Nine of Cups is a, the Nine of Cups is a card of feeling happy and content, satisfied. Um, it can also be a card of wishing for something as well, right? So I do feel like this person, you know, they could wish things or could be different or they could wish for something more. I feel like you could also wish that things could be different and wish for something more here. Um, but the Eight of Cups here for their intentions. I'm getting a couple different things with that. For some of you guys, this person could intend to walk away from their situation, okay? Um, but I feel like it's one of those things that are easier said than done. And some of you guys, their intention is to just walk away from you. The thing is, is either way, it kind of feels like it's going in the same direction. Even if their intention is to walk away from their connection, it looks like they're having a hard time actually doing that. Okay, for some of you guys, I don't even feel like that's really their intention with that eight of cups being their intention towards you. You know, they could know that this is something that's just, um, you know, it's here for right now. I'm gonna put it like that. They have the sun energy for their next action and behavior. I feel like they're choosing to just be present and enjoy it, the time with you, right? They're just trying to enjoy and be happy the time that they do have with you here. Now we have the world energy as the challenge. So one, I feel like this is, it's hard for you to kind of close things out with them, even though I feel like you guys do want more here, or you, you know, I feel like, I feel like you know this can't stay like this forever here. So for some of you guys, Aquarius, I feel, um, I just feel like you're having a hard time closing this out with this person, but I feel like this could also, is also them. And I feel like they have a hard time closing it out with you. I feel like they have a hard time walking away from their other person here. So it does kind of feel, um, it just feels like, Either way, it's hard, okay? I feel like it's just kind of hard all the way around. They can't walk away from you. You're having a hard time walking away from them. They don't want to, they're not ready to walk away from their other person. So that seems to be the challenge. Ultimately, it does look to me, Aquarius, that you kind of are going to step into a space where the King of Swords is somebody who has, sets really boundaries, sets high boundaries, or, you know, it has to cut something off here that's just not good for them anymore. So... Let's go ahead and see what signs are here. We have Pisces. We got Pisces here three times, okay? So you have a lot of Pisces energy here. So it could be a Pisces that you're dealing with or Pisces season could just be significant for you in some way. Um, you have Leo energy. You have all the fixed signs, Taurus, Scorpio, Leo, and Aquarius. And then you have Aquarius again. So some of you guys, it could be an Aquarius as well. I do see Scorpio here too, um, right under that. I do feel like you guys started to really develop feelings for this person here with that. Uh, king of cups energy being here and i feel like that's why ultimately you're 
having to get to this space where you cut things off here because I just feel like it's becoming too hard for you, especially for those of you where this person is expressing to you that they are going to leave that situation and then their, their actions don't match up to that. Um, but even for those of you where that's not the case, where this person has been up front with you and, and it's expressed to you that they don't plan on leaving them, you know, and then this is just kind of for what it is right now, I think that that's okay for a time for you. But I do feel like at some point here, because of the feelings that you develop with them, I do feel like that gets harder. And I feel like that's where you end up stepping into this energy with them of having to, um, you know, cut something out here, you know, or set really high boundaries or just, you know, be very direct with a person about where you're at with things. So that is what I have for you, Aquarius. I do hope that this helps. Now, if this resonates, let me know. If it doesn't, that's okay. Just check out your other placements and everything that you'll need to know, whether it's about this reading or scheduling your personal readings. All of that is in the description box below for you. And if you want personal prayers for any reason at all, you can just put the little prayer emoji in the comments down below, and then I will go through and pray for you. But if this is where we part, thank you guys so much for being here, and I will see you next time.